What's going on everybody, it's TG Smooth coming at you with Tom Clancy's The Division and we have another weapon review today. Um, so going straight into it, today we are going to be reviewing the custom P416G3. Um, so it's looking like the it, it is an assault rifle but uh, the base damage is 9088 which is pretty decent for an assault rifle, 750 rounds per minute with a 58 round max size accuracy reload speed and stability is looking at about 50 percent a little bit more um, on some of them and range is on the lower side the talents are meticulous killing a target has a 22.5 percent chance to instantly refill the magazine I don't have enough electronics for that talent so it's not useful to me um, the next talent, which I think is what's going to be the bread and butter of this weapon, is destructive. Armor destruction value is increased by 17% when using this weapon. And we see this on guns like the Pecan uh, LMG and other LMGs. You can get a roll on that. Um, and the last talent is commanded. Every kill performed while a signature skill is active extends its duration by 18%. Now moving on to my mods, I have all high-end mods, so here's what I use. I use an extended mag with plus 94% mag size and plus 11% weapon damage. I use a CQ BSS scope FDE for plus 22% headshot and plus 7% critical hit chance and a muzzle break plus 36.5 stability plus 35 percent critical hit damage and angled grip plus 31 percent stability and plus 20 percent accuracy now my build is primarily built around crit hit chance and critical hit damage um, this weapon is not an SMG so it's not gonna have a lot of critical hit damage or critical hit chance I mean I said <laughs> um, but anyways I got all weapons damage bonus. I don't even know how I got that. That's amazing though. Um, and let's go ahead and see damage to elites plus 11 and enemy armor damage is a total of 26% while using this weapon. Moving on we're gonna go into the base damage of course 9088 crit hit chance is looking like oh my god it's so fast 18,812 and then headshot damage 17,903 and then 37k for a critical headshot moving on to a long range target we're gonna skip medium range 8957 damage uh, let's see if we can get a crit we can 18k for a crit and then 17,643 for a regular headshot uh, uh. Can we get a critical? And 36,000 and some for a critical headshot at long range, which isn't bad for an assault rifle. Um, so we're going to move to phase two of our review and go to a challenge mission and test this out on what is arguably the hardest enemies in the game so far. So we're going to head to the Lincoln Tunnel, guys, and we'll BRB. Alright, and we're back at the Lincoln Tunnel on challenging mode. We're going to run down here and engage this first group as we always do. Let you guys see how these weapons hold up against the hardest. That what? What's going on? Where are they at? Okay. So a little bit of story to tell. I've done reset my Xbox because <laughs> this has happened. Um, and... These guys are just not appearing. I've restarted the game, restarted my Xbox, tried to restart the mission. Um, I don't know what's going on here. So <laughs> we're going to have to skip this part, I, I suppose, unless we do like matchmaking. But that usually takes too long, and I really want to get this video out there. Um, by the way, guys, I forgot to mention, you do get this weapon from the vendor in DZ3. Yeah, right here. Um, so that's where you would buy this weapon at currently. I don't know if it's still going to be there after the vendor resets the weapon. 
but that's where I got it from. It is only level 30, so it isn't a level 31 weapon, which sucks because it could be a little bit better, but we're just going to have to make do. Um, so I guess we're going to go ahead and teleport up to DZ6 just to test this weapon out. I, I apologize. Um, I don't know what's going on with the Lincoln Tunnel checkpoint. Maybe in the last uh, patch or server reset, they only allow you to do the challenging missions once a day because uh, I already did that mission to get some Phoenix credits. I, I don't know what's going on, honestly. So we're going to go up in here to the DZ West checkpoint and there should be a biohazard zone we always go to to test these weapons. We're just going to head there and maybe we'll do a little bit more uh, dark zone gameplay so you guys can get a feel for this weapon and decide if it's worth having in your arsenal. Unless these guys aren't here. I mean, people could have done picked them off. Oh, oh, there's one guy. Um, so we might have to move on to a different area. Oh no, oh, okay. More, more repaired. So you can see it eats through their armor um, pretty fast. Let's go ahead and just kind of rush these. Ooh, ooh. Hey, you dropped something, buddy. And you can see about 28 bullets left, so um, 30 bullets just took out a level 32 enemy, uh, and that's not even all headshots or anything like that. We're going to go ahead and search around a little bit more. Ooh, 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 that's hot. Alright, now there's some enemies here. Uh, the boss isn't here, so this video is <laughs> um, not going the way it usually goes, but you know what? We're, we're just going to go with the flow. We'll, we'll just have a little bit of fun, and you guys can see um, I can tank a little bit of damage. Um, not too much, though. Not with this build. I'm more of a... I wouldn't say glass cannon, because I do have some healing and... Um, all that good stuff and a decent amount of armor on. Um, so I guess we'll just run around and we got about a couple minutes we can spare and just run around DZ6, show you guys how this weapon works. Um, but I also would like to add, I almost forgot, uh, thanks for coming and hanging out with me today, by the way, and watching the video. I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you guys uh, find this useful. And if you do, don't forget to show your support. Smash that thumbs up button for me. It helps more than you guys realize. It keeps the motivation up. It makes me want to do better and better videos. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for uh, more daily videos. With that said, though, don't don't be scared to drop a comment below. Um, let me know how I'm doing. I'm always, always, always open to constructive criticism. Um, not not anything negative, but you know, constructive. Anything that will help the channel, or you feel like would help the channel, guys, please, by all means, feel free to mention it. If the audio quality is crap, which in the past, it has known to, to be uh, pretty crappy. And I'm getting myself killed because I'm talking too much. <laughs> um, then, then feel free to tell me, and I'll do my best to fix it. Uh, I really want to make this channel happen. Uh, if you guys don't know, I am a disabled vet, so this is kind of what I do on my free time. Um, I'm not really able to hold a, a steady job. I have kind of some, <laughs> some mental issues. It's embarrassing, but I do have PTSD. I've been deployed twice. Um, so this is what I do on my free time, and this is how I'm trying to make a living. Uh, in real life, I really generally am like uh, estranged to to people I'm not saying I don't have any friends or anything like that because I because I do but most of them's in the military or, or have some kind of military background um, so it, it's a lot easier for me and my friends to understand each other and the same as the people I play with online uh, with that said though we're gonna take a real quick break since I died like a jackass <laughs> and um, we're gonna go down to DZ1 where we're more likely to find players other players and rogues and we're gonna test this weapon out on them 
I hope you guys enjoyed so far. Stay tuned. Alright guys, and we're back in the DZ. Uh, we ran into a group and they agreed to, well Frost over here agreed to 1v1 me. Uh, so I don't get mowed down by four people. So whenever you're ready, I guess I'm ready. All right, three. Oh, you're gonna start with the two, eight. <laughs> one. <laughs> oh, that hurt. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, come on. <laughs> 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 You don't kill me? Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I, I shouldn't have killed bro? you. If you want to kill me and get, get keys back and stuff, I have plenty. Uh, you want to go? Is, is it Yabo? Yabo? Am I saying that right? Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Gunplay, I know, you, I know your new nickname. Your new nickname is Yabo. 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 You, you want to do this? <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. All right. Uh, get your buddy to heal you up it. or something. Oh no, I'm good, man. Nah, he's pretty beefy, dude. We're trying oh, to sway him out. Yeah, he's pretty beefy. <laughs> I have a lot of armor. A, a lot is the of picture armor. of you holding a gun? Yes, I used to be in the military. <laughs> Okay, I see Fallout 4, 3 videos, 39 ARC videos, and 16 Division videos. I subscribe, sir. Oh, sweet. You're awesome. Alright, Yabo, whenever you're ready, I'm going to give a <laughs> countdown. Yabo. 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 Got he. Three. Yabo. Two. Yeah. One. <laughs> oh, he's man, he's got a lot two. of armor. One. Holy crap. Up. Woo! Woo! Oh. Nice! Nice on the roll! Oh. Let me take him Yeah, out. you can pick oh. him up if you want. Uh, oh. I think I owe somebody keys. Yeah, pick Frost. Him up. Bro. Oh, okay. Yeah, I owe Frost <laughs> some keys. <laughs> I'll respawn right down the street. Alright, you wanna yeah, I don't want again? none, so y'all stay the fuck away from me. There's enemies down here. Bruh. That's I've never heard it. <laughs> Yabo. <laughs> well, it's Y A B O. I, I mean, if yeah. if you put it into one word, it looks like yeah. Yabo. Okay, hold on. What what would you how would you say the rest of it? I G U L L E. I mean, I, I, I got to look at it real quick. Hold on. I'm I'm respawning. <laughs> this is awesome. I appreciate you guys doing this for me. Uh a lot of people yeah, wouldn't do that. I oh, mean, fuck. my bad, was, my bad. I so we're not your average assholes. Was a while ago. Right, uh, or the so update, a while which, ago. which one of you were talking about making a YouTube channel? Frost. Frost? Frost? Alright, well, Frost, whenever yeah. you Frosty. do, man, I'll be sure to uh, collaborate with you and do some videos with you, man. Hey, we got players over here. They're trying to get at uh, Red Redneck. Oh yeah, you guys are still ready. You might want to head out. Oh, is there some guys over there? There, yeah. There oh are no, that's TG Smooth. That's, that's me. Come on. No, there's t there's there's someone else down there. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah, three other players. There are three there. other people over there. We, there's we should take them out. Oh, yeah, I don't Ooh, care I about slaying you. them out. There's fatal friction. <laughs> oh, oh, dude, I didn't think if I shot him, I'd motherfucking get killed. Like, I'm doing it. Whoa. I'm doing it! All right, let's I mowed one down. Let's slam up. Oh, he's down. I'm coming. All right, I'm by the ambulance. Oh, oh, that's that's. Wait, watch it, watch it. Someone's behind Ooh. the ambulance. Oh, is that that us? My bad, Frost. My bad, dog. I seen that. And I was like, I, oh, this my. <laughs> I see him. Oh, he, oh, he popped damage resistance. I I lit him up. Hey, up. watch out! Watch, like watch out! I, I threw a turret down. Watch it. Mm. Yeah, he's got his immunity buff or whatever. Oh, heals. Try not to hit smooth over here. Ooh, I flashbang myself. 
He's so confused right now. He don't even know what's uh, happening. Don't step in that. We're sorry, Dan. Right. Thanks for a good video. <laughs> oh, you didn't have nothing anyway. Alright, guys. I think that's <laughs> it for this part. We're going to head back to the firing range after we mess around in DZ a little bit. And we'll be right back. Oh, oh. And we're back. For our final conclusion of the custom P416 G3 review. Uh, Jesus, it sounds like I'm calling out grid coordinates. Um, so anyways, we're going to dive right into it, guys. Base damage, I'm going to give this 3 out of a 5. Um, the reason being, even with uh, an extended mag with additional weapon damage, it's still only pushing 8,500 damage. Um... So we're going to give it three stars there. Crit stats, if you guys look here, full mag, 59 rounds, or 59 bullets, I should say. And we only got about three crits out of that. Um, the crit damage is pretty decent, especially if you're shooting heads. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So if you're getting all headshots, 11 crit shots, and that's because of a talent I have where uh, crit shots have a 50% chance to uh, kind of like regenerate the bullet or, or not consuming the bullet. So that's why we're giving that two stars. Otherwise, I think it would be one star. That's not a lot of crit for this weapon. Um, survivability, we're going to give three stars. It doesn't have any talents on it that give us any self-heal. Or, or anything like that. The reason why I'm giving it 3 star though is because the additional um, damage to enemy armor, which is pretty good for PvE. Um, and then if you have a build that's based on kind of like, I, I guess you would call it an armor pin build, this gun would be perfect, a, a perfect assault rifle for that type of build. So we're going to go ahead and give it 3 stars for that. And sustainability, we are also going to give 3 stars. Um, you guys can see, like, it's not too, too stable, um, shooting at a long distance, but if you fire it in bursts with your right trigger, it does the job. I mean, it, it don't, I, I've seen worse guns bounce all over the place, especially LMGs. Uh, it, it's pretty accurate, though. The bullets feel like they're, they're landing exactly where you're aiming as well. And the range, there's not a lot of damage fall off on the range, so we're going to go ahead and give it three stars. So, tolling that up, that gives this 11 out of 20. I hope you guys enjoyed the review. Um, you do get this from one of the DZ vendors in DZ3 I showed you guys earlier. Um, if you're interested in checking it out, uh, you've seen the PvP footage. It's not too great for PvP um, unless it's a weaker opponent because it's a level 30 weapon. It's not level 31 or else I could see this being a little bit better and maybe around 13, 14 out, out of 20 because I, I believe that would increase the stats a lot more, the damage. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you found this helpful, don't forget to show your support. Slap that thumbs up button for me. It keeps me motivated. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Besides that, guys, this is TG Smooth out. And remember to stay smooth. Peace.